This country is unbelievable. This is the only country this is happening in the world. People are queuing up after arriving their country to fill forms. They're asking us, I've done 16 hours on flight. I have to. What's not allowed? What's not allowed? What's not allowed? What do you mean it's not allowed? Show me where it's, it's said here. It's written. No, I know my, I know my, I know my, I know the laws. I know my rights. I know the laws. I work for, by the way, I work for Hungary and Angry. Have you heard of Hungary and Angry before? Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. Let me address, let me address the gentleman. I know that, except if you want to come here, you will want to explain this. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Sir, you don't have to, you don't have to shout. That's what they want in the country. Everybody shouts. I don't shout. Sir, sir, do you want to take care of this? Okay, can I just talk to the gentleman? It's not a problem. Okay, don't touch my clothes, please, when you talk to me. Don't touch me. Just talk to me. Okay? No, what is that? That's my phone. What's wrong with that? No, no, no. Tell me. No, 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 no. Tell me why. That's my phone. That's my, that's my right in this country. Okay? I video police. I video governors. I video president. I don't have a... No, no. What I'm saying to you, this place, this place is a... This place is a public place. No, what is not allowed in the airport? Show me signs where it's written. No, no, show me signs where it said that video is not allowed. No, because you know what I'm saying? I'm a journalist, I'm reporting what is happening here right now. You see what is happening here has to be changed by the government. It's not allowed. People cannot travel 16 hours, come back to their country. No, no, you, I don't, I'm not going to depend on your report, sir. No, no, I'm not going to report, depend on your report, okay? What I'm doing, I make change. No, don't, you are coming on my phone. Don't touch my phone. You are the one walking to my phone. I didn't come to you. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. No, no, please. That's my phone. You don't have right to touch it. Okay? You don't know how many people are seeing you. Don't, don't make yourself look stupid before the world. Okay? So if you want to talk to me, talk to me nicely. Don't touch my phone, sir. That's my phone. Okay? Show me where it's said it's not allowed. I want to change what is happening here. It has to be changed. I will do it. I have that power to change it, sir. I, I can change it. When I show to the world what is happening here, they will know that people cannot go 16 hours and come back here and they are feeling forms. We are queuing up. Are we goats in Nigeria? This is the only place where this happens in the world. But, uh, this thing that you are doing, this is, you, if you want to ask questions, you ask No, I'm not asking you questions. I'm doing my thing. I don't need to ask you questions. If you want me to ask you questions, sir, I can ask. Do you want me to ask you questions? Yeah. Good. You, you can't just come like that and do that. That's not nice. Where are you coming from, sir? Syria. Syria. Are you happy with what you're seeing here? No, I passed three airports. Three airports. Oh, three airports, yes. Okay. Route, Lebanon, and the two are now real. Okay. But normally, do like this. Okay. This is not nice. Nigerian government has to stop this straight away. I wish. Yeah, they have to stop it. We cannot travel 16 hours and come here. They ask us to fill form. Their intern, their portal is not working. You go online to fill the form. It's not working. We can't pay cash here. They're telling me I cannot even pay with my British. Uh, 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 a no. bank account. So what am I going to do? Go back. Everybody is aggressive at the airport. This has to be changed. It's not going to happen again. Okay? It's not a good situation. I'm sure, I'm sure they are doing something. Thank you for Thank you your so cooperation. Much. Thank you so much, my dear. Yeah. Guys, the video you saw there, it was real. Okay? It was happening right there in Abuja International Airport. Okay? I had done my own COVID test from London. I didn't pay no money. Okay. It was free. And I traveled London via Ethiopia. And as soon as I arrived in Nigeria, there were loads of queue, long queue of people waiting to pay another money for COVID tests. Like the one I done in London is not valid. Nigerian hospitals are better than London hospitals. Is that what you're saying to me? But you know what? I had to pay another 40,000 naira, okay? And then they gave me a paperwork, okay? That is the paperwork that they gave me. They gave me this paperwork, okay? They said to me, um, this is my receipt for the payment, and this is the clinic that I have to go. It's called EHA Clinic. 
let me say something to you. I've arrived home now. I'm in my hometown. I've Googled the Eha Clinic. They don't have a branch around here. They only have a branch in Abuja. But they told me that they have a branch everywhere in Nigeria. What it means now is that I have to short stay my visit and then I have to leave three days to go to Abuja, do a test, and then come back to my hometown and then go back to Lagos again and catch a flight. Shame on you, government. Shame on you, Buhari government. You're sitting down there at airport waiting for our people coming back home to extort them. You're extorting money from people who are coming back, Nigerians. You're frustrating us. You're frustrating us. You're taking our money. Everybody at the airport is an agent of evil, agent of darkness. The government is also an agent of darkness. You plant your people there to extort money from us. What have we done to you? We didn't create COVID. Why are you suffering us with COVID? You're suffering Nigerians in Nigeria, and you're also suffering Nigerians coming back abroad to be with loved ones. Shame on you, Nigerian government. And you know what again? Shame on you. Shame on you, the Nigerian citizens who sit down there and watch the government treat us like a piece of shit. Okay? My name is... Dr. Chido Agonabo. I work for Hungry and Angry. We are really hungry and angry. We are hungry for change and we are angry at no change.